Good evening, welcome back to a brand new IRT Teams video. Hope you're all doing well. For cheap, fast and reliable FIFA 20 Ultimate Team coins, check out u7buy.com and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. Before we get into this episode, I just want to quickly say, if you aren't subbed to the channel, please, please, please subscribe to the channel. We're trying to hit 150k by FIFA 21 and we are just about 1,000, 1,150 away. It's really close. Hopefully we could do it. We've got about a month to do it. Fingers crossed. Thank you all for the epic support you've been showing on the channel this year. Uh, you guys, honestly, I've been saying this for the last year. You guys have changed my life just from the support you've been giving me the last couple of years. And I'm immensely grateful. So thank you all for that. Enjoy the episode. All right. You guys know the drill. Most of these are just going to be showcases. I'm going to be showing you guys people's end game teams. A few of them will, of course, want a little bit of guidance here and there. But we are pretty much in, I would say, the last three weeks of FIFA 20. And what I mean by that is... In the next three weeks, we are going to transition from FIFA 20 content to FIFA 21 content. When EA dropped the Foot 21 reveal, which I think is in, it's on Monday at 4 p.m., I'm pretty sure, uh, we'll kind of know what the squad building section of FIFA 21 will look like. And that's when I start doing FIFA 21. I rate your teams, getting some advice on what you guys think for certain players for sort of teams. Uh, sort of preempting what I think, like, say, a cheap team will look like, what I think an expensive team will look like, that sort of stuff. So make sure you're sticking around the channel for that. So we're going to start off with Surface Prawn YT's team. This is my team for KS to Stegen. The only trade awards. Can I have a team rating? Of course you can, mate. Of course you can. Nice. Okay, so for KS to Stegen, the only trade awards. So you've got a lot of really nice and tradable cards there. Um, and you're playing Ribery up top. Interesting. I mean, it's a decent team. I would maybe put Fakir Central, to be honest. And the only reason why is because uh, I think he's got the lowest pace out of all of those, the front four. So I'd say maybe Central IST would be better. But, hey, that team's a solid for me. 9.9 uh, .9 out of 10. The only reason why you're not getting a 10 out of 10 is because our was on 7 cam. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm doing it again. I'm doing it again. Uh, here we go. Next one from Carter. Uh, this is his team. He's got 600,000 coins and he's looking for improvements and a rating. For me, for 600k with this team, I'd say maybe get yourself a better left back. Oh no, you need that link to Eder Militao. My bad, never mind. Uh, ignore that. I would say for 600k, you could probably afford a decent moments icon CDM over Allen. Uh, thinking about it, like maybe a moments Balak would probably work pretty well. I don't know how much he is these days. I'd assume he's not that expensive. Yeah, you can afford Moments Balak. I'd get Moments Balak there because you've already got a small CDM in Matthias. Uh, apart from that, it's a really, really solid team. I do like it. Uh, next one coming from Zach. I uh, hope you're doing well. Everyone's untradeable except for Alwa. I've got 50 to 100k for improvements. Keep up the amazing vids. I appreciate that, my man. Uh, I don't know why it's blurry. It's Twitter quality. Twitter uh, have a terrible HTML for, for uh, photo quality. And I don't know why, but he's got the Ansu who's getting an upgrade. Uh, by the way, that's Zhao Felix today. Ooh, pretty decent card. Not bad value, to be fair. I suppose it is August, though. So EA got to be giving out some decent value SPCs here and there. This team is good. This team is a very good team. Um, obviously, you've got no improvements you're making. Let's be real. You're not even looking for improvements. Like, you just want to kind of showcase the team. It's a great team. I like it a lot. I think the team works really well. Uh, I'm, I've decided now... Like, I just decided in my head then, you know, just decided then, make it, made an executive decision to the, <laughs> to the series. Um, I'm not going to do out of 10s because there'll be two teams, I guarantee, that are exactly the same. And I'll give one a 9.9 .9 and a one a 9.5. And it's, but why would you give that? My brain works strangely when I record videos. So I'm just going to say good, great, awful, amazing, you know? Um, this is a nice team. I like this team a lot. Premier League team. To be fair, like this year, I feel like we haven't really seen any, like, Prem only teams like this, or we haven't for a while, should I say? I'm not entirely sure about Bruno Fernandez at striker, um, and I'm not entirely sure about Gini Wijnaldum at Cam. Uh, I feel like you've got too many sort of midfielders here and not enough strikers. Uh, but yeah, no, the team is decent. Um, I like it. How's Ogbonna? That's one I would uh, be interested to know how Ogbonna is. Uh, next one coming from Jake. Second pick is in game. Everyone untradeable. Got 100,000 coins for improvements. I love the vids. By the way, apologies if you could hear. Any any noise, any 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 motorbikes or cars going down. I have a quite a main road basically outside here, and it's just too hot to shut the windows, even to just to record a 10, 20 minute video. Um, I do apologize, but people like to be really obnoxious and just speed down the country road. I don't know why, um, but it is what it is. Anyway, next team uh, is from Jake. Uh, second pick is in game, and everyone untradeable. Nice. Okay, moments Makalele. It's interesting. One. I haven't really seen anyone use it before. This is a good team though. I do like the team. Um, obviously, I, got, I see you using uh, Nelson Semedo. Nice. 
Uh, yeah, no, this is a great team. I like this team a lot. Maybe swap... Uh, hmm, never mind. I was going to say, yeah, no, maybe swap Bernardo and Pulisic. I feel like this year you don't really do crossbody shots as much, so maybe Bernardo on the right, to cut in on his left, and then Pulisic, vice versa. Uh, but the rest of it is really good. We have got Bruda's team, who says, uh, this is my team. Can you suggest improvements? Everything is untradeable. Uh, I have 20,000 coins. Well, you ain't making improvements for 20k. No, this team doesn't really need improvements. I'd say if you're going to make any improvements ever, I think the only improvement... I mean, first of all, change to an, an ordinary 4-4-3 maybe. I feel like you could probably get better chemistry like that um, and, and put Pogba as your central centre mid. Would that work? That would work. Yeah, 4-3-3, normal, flat. Pogba central centre mid and, uh, and Richarlison left centre mid. You've got full cam on genuinely everyone in the team there, I think. Yeah, I think you have uh that works better in my opinion uh but no this seems great this seems very very good uh i'm guessing you're a man united fan i see you got dan james sanchez uh greenwood pogba maybe not but no it's a decent team though i like it uh it's a good team uh the next one coming from drew uh all the summer heats Maguire and brian are untradeable i could have guessed that i could have guessed that no, i'm joking uh i've got a million coins in the minute i got you bro Another great team. For a million coins, like, I'm pretty sure you can get a better version of EVD. Uh, what's the what's the foot birthday saying? 6 k for the foot birthday. It's a bit expensive still for the 99s, though, don't you think? A little bit expensive. I mean, you could maybe get the foot birthday, Van Dyke. Apart from that, like, team's great. You know, team is really good. I would say, yeah, like, the only thing I'd say is sell your Van Dyke and get a better version. Apart from that, really good team. How is Brian? Because I've heard fantastic things about the card, and I'd like to see if it is, in fact, solidified. With your opinion. Uh, we've got Frankie Piper's team. Hi, Ryan. Hope you're well. Can I get a rating out of 10? And should I play Vini over Ronaldinho? No. All in trade except for team of the year Mbappe, who I purchased. 200,000 coins for upgrades. 40 for a running game. Yeah, no. Uh, Ronaldinho. One thing I will say, and I'd love to hear what you guys think of this. I feel like even icons that have a lot less stats compared to some of Heats, I feel like the icons still play better. Just because icons... It's like they have hidden stats this year. It's like they just play differently. They play more solid. I don't know what it is, but I feel like icons are just way better than pretty much every other type of card on the game, which is why you see me still using, for example, like a 90 Hullet or a Maldini or a Baby Uzet, like a lot of the icons, because they're just, I feel like they're more reliable than Summer Heats. I don't know what it is. It's really strange. And if you if you disagree, please let me know in the comments down below. But uh, but Frankie, that team is fantastic. Improvements wise, I don't think you can really make any improvements to this team again. These are all like end game teams. Um, Tom is just flexing his 99 Ronaldo, who he already owns. So I think actually, to be fair, it's a bit of an L for you because you already own him. So it's a duplicate. So yeah, uh, that for you. Please, all I ask, please don't... Don't put your pack pools in the hashtag it's Haber. Like, this is for teams only. Uh, we have got Albert's team. Uh, what we're looking at here. Oh, this is what you're playing game. A four and two and two wide. Okay. Uh, do you start this? Yeah, you do. And then obviously, I mean, hey, you got... Wow, that is an insane pick. 99 De Bruyne, 97 Salah. Nice. Uh, this team is phenomenal. This team is really, really good. I would say the only thing... I mean, 300,000, you can't afford anything. 300k. But let's say you come into some coins. You get lucky. You come into some coins. I would say Messi over over Griezmann at, at that central cam uh, or central centre mid spot. Um, whichever Messi you go with, I don't know, but like a shapeshifter or something would work really, really well. We have Carter's team next. Have I already done Carter's team? I have already done Carter's team. I'm uh, losing me marbles. We got Armin's team though, 435k. Every team here says Tots is untradeable. Sorry, is tradable. Play 43 almost CR7 at striker. Wow, that's a god team. That is a very god team. By God, I mean good. Um. Can you maybe get an icon over at right centre back? That wouldn't improve Ronaldo's cam at all. I'm trying to think. Is, guys, in the comments down below, is there a way that you can get full chemistry or just better chemistry with a different formation? Or is this the best you can get? This team is, is still phenomenal. Obviously, it's 100 cam. And actually, to be fair, the only person off cam is Ronaldo. Never mind. Uh, I, I, yeah, no, he's actually literally got everyone off full cam bar Ronaldo. Ignore that. This team is insane. This team is actually insane. Um, I like it a lot. It's a, this is a very, very good team. It's one of the best teams I've seen um, for the last few weeks, to be fair. Really, really nice. And what I would say is, obviously, they're tradable cards as well, like Ronaldo's tradable, Messi's tradable, that sort of stuff. What do you do? Do you buy FIFA points? Do you trade? I'd love to hear what you do, and I'd love to hear if you're still playing Weekend League every week. Um, that was uh, that would be something I'm intrigued to hear more about. Um, we have got next up... 
uh, Valtteri's team. We'll do Valtteri and Clerco and call it for that episode, I think. Uh, Valtteri's team, I pulled Messi today. I'm wondering what I should do with the coins. Like 3.1 million. Thanks, mate. Well, that's crazy. I mean, all I'll ask you, do you necessarily need the coins? Is it a necessity or can you use them? Like, it's, at the end of the day, it is a 99 Messi, right? He's insane. If you've not already sold him, I know this is a little bit late. It's August 3rd that this, this was sent in. So it's quite a while ago. I've, uh, uh, a lot of these teams, they would have been sent in at the start of the week. And because we don't really get any any entries anymore, like like in comparison to what we get at the start of FIFA, um, I, I pretty much get everyone in the episodes now. Uh, I would say maybe try and use Messi if you've not sold him. Apart from that, like if you've sold him, I would say it's, it's going to sound silly, but like, SPCs, man. Icon packs, if you get like a 90 plus tots pack or like just have a bit of fun at this point, I think. Um, your team is endgame, so you can just have a bit of fun. And the only thing that improved this team really now is like huge moments icon. So if you're going to if you're gonna go for it, just have a bit of fun, I would say. And we got Clarko's team to end it off. Uh, can you rate my team? Allison is the only untradeable of the vids, man. Uh, hope you can hit 150k by FIFA 21. Yeah, fingers crossed we can. Um, this is what we're looking at. So, I've already rated Clerco's team in this episode. Uh, we'll end it off with Sam and Thomas instead. Uh, this is Sam's team. Uh, very nice team. Uh, hmm. Yeah, no, I mean, like, there is genuinely nothing I would change with this team either. It's a really, really nice team. Uh, end game, really, really good. And then we've got Thomas Duff's team to end it off. Um, this actually is one of the, the cheaper teams we've seen so far. I would say with this team... Uh, get that Jao Felix that just came out. It's cheap. It's decent value for me. Uh, in my opinion, sorry. Not for me, but in my opinion. I would then say maybe go with just like a... See if you can save up towards a Ramos. Uh, maybe save up towards a normal to Sagan. And then maybe save up to a better left back. But yeah, it's, it's, the rest of the team, you've got the right idea. You're going in the right direction. Um, and uh, and it will event eventually become a really good team. So thank you all for watching this episode. If you guys did enjoy, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.